بعد تعرض قواعد عسكرية روسية لهجمات يسود اعتقاد واسع نطاق أن كييف نفذتها أكدت الولايات المتحدة أنها لا تشجع أوكرانيا على تنفيذ ضربات في العمق الأوروبي وقال وزير الخارجية الأمريكي أنطوني بلينكين أن بلاده لم تشجع ولم تمكن الأوكرانيين من تنفيذ ضربات داخل روسيا متأهما في الوقت نفسه موسكو باستخدام الشتاء سلاحا عبر شن هجمات على بنى تحتية مدنية um. We have neither encouraged nor enabled uh, the Ukrainians to uh, strike inside of Russia. Uh, but the important thing is to understand what Ukrainians are living through every day with the ongoing Russian aggression against their country and our determination to make sure that they have um, in their hands, along with many other partners around the world, the uh, equipment that they need to defend themselves, to defend their territory, uh, to defend their freedom. كما لفت بلينكن إلى أن تحالف الناتو يعزز من قدراته العسكرية للتصدي لأي عدوان قد تتعرض له دوله. China is watching very carefully what's happening in in Ukraine, watching very carefully the response of the United States and countries around the world to the Russian aggression, and what they've seen are countries coming together in extraordinary ways. to make sure that Ukraine has what it needs to defend itself, to put tremendous pressure on Russia uh, to end its aggression, and as well to make sure that, uh, in the case of NATO, we're strengthening our own capacity to defend ourselves in case that aggression. من جهته لفت وزير الدفاع الأمريكي لويد أوستن أيضا إلى أن واشنطن قدمت أكثر من 19 مليار دولار مساعدات أمنية لأوكرانيا. The U.S. working to prevent Ukraine from developing its own long-range uh, strike capability. The short answer is no. We're absolutely not doing that. Uh, you, as you've seen, we've spent well over uh, $19 billion uh, in providing security assistance to Ukraine. Um, we have, uh, in addition to that, uh, engaged uh, allies and partners routinely to uh, to get them uh, to provide assistance as well, security assistance as well. هذا وأظهرت صور لأقمار الصناعية حجم الضرر الذي أصاب قاعدتين جويتين روسيتين بسبب تعرضهما لهجوم أوكراني بطائرات المسيرة.